Robin Hood and Little John walking through the forest, laughing back and forth at what the other nests say. Reminiscing this and that and having such a good time. Oodle lolly, oodle lolly, golly, what a day. Never ever thinking there was danger in the water they were drinking, they just guzzled it down. Never dreaming that a scheming sheriff and his posse was a watching them and gathering around. Robin Hood and Little John running through the forest, jumping fences, dodging trees, and trying to get away. Contemplating nothing but escaping, finally making it. Ooh la la, ooh la la, golly, what a day! Ooh la la, ooh la la, golly, what a day! Welcome back, everybody, to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Welcome back to the Legion expansion in World of Warcraft. Today, we are going to be starting the Invasion Point OOBs. And uh, I don't know why I never thought about these before, about getting out of bounds in the Invasion Points and uh, on Argus. Um, cur currently, we came from Aerodeth. Aerodeth. And uh, we're in the invasion point right here. And uh, we are in Bon... Bo Bonich? Bonich? I don't know how to say it. Bo Bonique? I don't know. Anyone know how to say it, let me know. Um, <laughs> anyways, yeah, we're in the Legion invasion point, And I've already gotten outside the map. All I did was, like, come right over here and just use one of my pillows of toys here and just got out. So we're going to go take a look around and see what's outside the map. Now, currently... Outside the map, there's a bunch of fog, so you can't really see much. But we're going to use our handy-dandy Sneaky Bright Potion. And there we go. Ooh, that's so much better. And we're going to go take a look around. So let's go see what we can find here outside the map. I'm excited to see what's out these. Now, I don't know if there's going to be too much, but it's still really neat to see these. I never really thought about doing the invasion points, so I thought, let's start the invasion points and see what we can do. Now, as you guys can tell... We're in a beautiful forest. Uh, I don't know where this forest is supposed to be in the game. I'm assuming... I, my guess is Grizzly Hills in Northern, maybe? I don't know. We're, I don't know where this is exactly. So, I'll have, I don't know. I should have looked that up for the video, huh? <laughs> I should have did a little bit of research, but that's okay. We're here for Out of Bounds, not Lore History. Now, as you guys can tell, they do have a big smoke and mirror effect here with all the trees and everything in the distance here, which is really neat. I mean, I love the colors going on. You got the orange. Oh, I love fall. Fall is my favorite time of the year. I don't know about you guys, but I love fall. Um, unfortunately, I live in California in the Bay Area, so we don't really have fall foliage to say. I mean, some parts we do, but most of it's just green and rainy and cloudy which is really nice too and i like that weather but we don't have like fall foliage like they do over in the east coast so i'm on the west coast of the united states and uh our foliage is eh, it's okay now if you go up to like oregon washington that type of stuff you'll see some pretty good foliage up there but yeah unfortunately where i'm currently at uh we don't really have foliage so that kind of sucks but because fall is my favorite time of the year and uh, i just love fall now let's keep going through this way and let's go take a stroll through the woods here. One of the things that I love about this outside, look how huge these trees are, by the way. Look at that. That thing's massive in game. Jeez. Like that model is ridiculous. Look, it just goes all the way up, like way up there. You can't even see the top of that thing. Wow. Now, I don't know if that's an actual tree or that's just like a picture with some branches hanging out. Maybe Submerge can tell me. <laughs> He's the game developer. Uh, I'm assuming these are modeled trees. I don't know. Let's go try to walk up to one of these things. I know this one is modeled. We're going to hit it. Yeah. Okay. So that one's modeled. I don't know if these big ones, these giant ones are modeled. Let's go try to take a look 
you know what, let's go ahead over this one right here. I want to go see if this thing is modeled or not, and if you actually saw and you run into it. I'm super curious now. And, oh, you walk straight through them. Okay, so they're not actually modeled. They're just, yep, all right, I actually called it. Look at that. They're just pictures with branches sticking out. <laughs> so the branches, my guess, are actually modeled, but the tree itself is not. So that's interesting to see. I didn't, yeah, I didn't think so. But let's go see, is this one modeled? Now I'm curious if every single tree is modeled. Ah, uh, Okay, yeah, that one's modeled. So the smaller ones are modeled, but the bigger ones are not. So I'm assuming this one, like right here, that's huge, is not modeled. And you can kind of tell by the glow of it, too. It looks fake compared to the other ones. You guys notice that? Like, if you look at a normal model tree, like right here, you can see it's kind of dark and it has, like, the shape and that. But you just see this. It looks like just a picture, which it is. It's just a giant picture. So that's really neat. This one might actually be real, but now outside of the map here, uh, enough with the big trees. <laughs> I'm all infatuated with the big trees. I'm like, ah, let's go check out all the trees. Well, we are in the forest after all, but I want to show you guys the edge of the world over here. So the map does cut off. There is an edge here and it does go all the way back. And you can tell right here, it goes up. So there you go. We're at the edge of the world now and you kind of get a greater view. I'm curious to see the other invasion points now. I don't I don't think I did too many invasion points during the Legion expansion. You know, I'm kind of disappointed in myself with World of Warcraft because I wish I would have played more during every expansion. I I what I would do is I would get I would buy an expansion, I'd be all hyped for it. I'd play it for like a month. And then I would drop off the game and then go back to League of Legends or, I don't know, something else that I was playing at the time. And then I would pick it up again. And play. So, like, I played every single expansion, but just not all the way through. So, I missed the whole Argus, you know? I missed, like, things in this game that I wish I would have stuck with more. But that's going to change. I mean, going forward, I'm super excited for The War Within. Um, I'm definitely going to be playing through that expansion, like, heavily. And uh, I did play through Dragonflight pretty well, so I, I, you know, I was very happy about that. And um, another expansion, what else did I play? Oh, I played through Cataclysm all the way. Uh, I played a lot through Miss of Pandaria when that first came out. I was just a teenager when that was released, so I was able to play these expansions. I played through Warlords of Draenor, but some of them I didn't play all the way through, and I really kicked myself for it because some of them look like a lot of fun and i know legion was pretty top tier of an expansion a lot of people love the legion expansion which i can see why great story and just you know the legion's always fun to deal with and fight right so anyways um as we're strolling through the woods you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna play um robin hood you know uh what's that song the Ro the the robin hood song Going through the forest. Uh, gosh, I'm going to have to look it up and play it now. Oh, look at this bird over here. Look at that. We got like a hummingbird. That's cool. And actually, it's just an NPC hanging out because I can't even... I can't target it either. Hopefully, if we get too close, it doesn't like fly away or something. Wow. That's neat. Oh, these are really cool. Look at one's red, one's green. Those are cute. Huh. I'm going to take a picture. All right, awesome. Do they have names or anything? No, they don't. Can we actually get up close to these things? Oh, we can. Look at this. Give you guys a better view. <laughs> these are some fun birds. Look at that thing. They're, these things are huge, too. Way bigger than my guy. Look, it's almost as big as my model. Look at this thing. <laughs> I got to get another picture here. All right, let's keep moving on. That was fun, though. What's funny is these are like way outside the map too. So I don't even know if you could see the things. Oh, look at these ghost horses running around. That's cool. Oh, this is really awesome. You know what? I'm going to get off the... I want to get on a quieter mount here. Let's just ride our Winter Saber. One of my all-time favorite mounts in the game. The winter spring frost saber and there you go so we are on um, by the edge of the map here so you actually could see the birds maybe 
that's pretty far away to see birds. I'm really surprised they're out there uh, that far. But if we're right here, this is where I basically got outside the map. I just jumped up here and put a pillow down and I was able to get out. So, all right, let's go take a stroll up this river. I want to see the backside of it. And I want to go see if it's just a, if an actual river or does it get cut off? I'm assuming it gets cut off. Now you can already see the, the bottom of the river here. Let's go see the back of this river. I'm, I'm, I want to see if it cuts off or not. It's a pretty out, out of bounds map. It's been awesome. Um, if you guys are into action, like like role playing servers, RP servers, and all that, this might be a cool place to do so do some like cool things like that. Now the okay, so the river does cut off. Look, it's like coming from the tree. <laughs> What's that all about? Look, we're actually inside of it. That's a neat shot, huh? All right, let's keep walking out this way. Let's go take a look out. Now, I think a lot of this is going to be the same. Ooh, what's this? Do you walk through it, or is that actually model? Oh, it is. Okay. What is this? Like a statue? Now I'm curious. I don't know. Oh, we can walk up it, though. Sorry, Tiger. I think I... I heard the frost saber. Oh, it's just a rock. Okay, so it's just like a rock with stuff sticking out. Ooh, look at that. We got all of this going on back here. So it's like a giant stone back here. Let's see here. Okay, I think we're making full circle here now. Because this is where we started. We started way over there. So we'll start heading in. But I do want to go see what is up here. Can we get up this cool looking waterfall? Oh, can we walk on top of the water? We can. We got a little lake action going on here. This is awesome. What are we in right now? Okay, we're in Havoc. Good. So we're going to use Fell Rush. Uh, we might need to switch to our <laughs> Infernal Strike, though. You know, this is one of the more prettier out of bounds I've ever done, I have to admit. Okay, so the water does just cut up. So it's not actually, look at that. So you got the waterfall starting here and it gives the illusion that it's dropping down and coming down this way. But there's actually nothing there. Look at that. All right. Um, okay, how are we gonna get up here is my question. Okay, that was a little dramatic, dude. Oh, I missed. I should have, uh shot higher with my metamorphosis here oh okay i think we just walk on the side of the mountain here yeah we could just jump in the little crevices here there we go making our way downtown uh where's our fell rush there it is okay it's back nice all right we made it up we're good we know what we're doing guys it's all good all right let's keep heading up here And we gotta... Oh! Don't fall! Ooh. I panicked, fell rushed. And one more time, and we made it to the top. Look at that. Demon Hunters can do anything. So let's see what's up here. Not too much, huh? <laughs> I thought more would be up here. I do love the pretty orange trees, though. So here's the top of the waterfall. It's an awesome shot. Man, beautiful. Beautiful scenery here. Look at that. Let's get a nice screenshot. I love taking the screenshots of awesome stuff. Look at that. Man, if I'm ever going to enter a screenshot competition, and wow, like this is where I might go. Um, I'm going to change out my fish for my frost saver. There we go. The winter spring. And let's go take a look in the back here. I don't think there is anything. Now, here's another tree that you could probably walk through, most likely. So let's go jump inside of it. There we go. Yep. And we are inside. So as you guys can see, here goes the other side of the map here. And the world does cut off again. Now, I haven't found any really thing interesting when it comes to, like, hidden test NPCs or anything outside, unfortunately. 
What is this random piece of thing? Look at that. Just one random piece on the ground just hanging out. Looks like a key or something. Alright, let's go head back inside the map. And I want to give you guys a... Oh, wow, that was all inside the tree. Man, that tree was massive. Alright, let's go take a look inside this way. And let's go full circle here. So this is where we ended up first. And, ooh, what's that over there? As much as this OOB doesn't have too much to it, it's kind of neat, actually. A really pretty OOB, that's for sure. There goes one of the other giant rocks. Actually, two giant rocks. All right, so now is your chance. Finish this fight. Uh, okay. I will, Illidan. I will finish the fight, buddy. In just a moment, as I'm done exploring. Look at these random, like, things running around. So now you got kind of the forest being alive out here. Are we back? Yep, okay, so we're right over here on the map here. Maybe the invasion was just kind of... Oh, you know what? I wonder if another player in the game is doing the invasion right now, and that's why. So I don't think this is solo. If I'm not mistaken. So that's why they were saying that. Ah, that's funny. So someone's been doing the invasion fight the whole time, probably. And I didn't even realize it. And they're just killing, killing the demons in there. But, well, guys, you know, that's pretty much it. I mean, there's not not too much to this out of bounds, but it is a pretty out of bounds and very, very pretty with the scenery and the environment. I do love it a lot. So if you love forests and you love walking around and seeing some mountains and all that, uh, <laughs> okay. All right. The doom of our world's upon us. Should have run when they had the chance. All right, cool. Look at that. Standing. Didn't even do anything. We could, look at us. We're so good. That's what I call a pro gamer move, right there. The legion from every world they defile. This is only the beginning. All right, guys, you heard it. It's only the beginning. <laughs> That's what I call a pro gamer move. Didn't even do anything, and I won. So, hmm, don't mess with me, legion. I'll take you out. Anyways, guys, I want to thank you for joining me on this Legion Invasion OOB. Uh, I know this was a little shorter of a video, but uh, it was a lot of fun to stroll through the forest here and check things out. Now you guys know what's outside the map. So if you get a chance, come check it out. It's a really neat, very pretty environment. Uh, really beautiful scenery here. And uh, yeah, anyways, guys, my name is Nathan. I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.